Uh, but you can see the rain, it swept even to southern Queensland overnight last night. It's eased back a touch there now. The bulk of the rain was overnight, but there's still a little rain band just southwest of Brisbane. And so we'll continue to see these totals climbing through the day. Coffs and Port Macquarie both managing more than 40 millimetres and Sydney 40 in the gauge as well. But today it looks a fair bit drier there, not as cold as yesterday. It was only 13. That is a remarkably chilly day by September standards uh, for Sydney siders. It really felt like winter had returned in abundance. Uh, but you can see the focus today of that low pressure system. It shifts a little bit out to sea. So the rain will ease back for many, but then into tomorrow it will come back towards the coast. Wet and windy weather, probably some severe rain and winds for parts of the north coast of New South Wales. But already the Bureau of Meteorology have issued a severe weather warning for damaging surf on the coast of the northern rivers and the southeast coast of Queensland in that yellow shaded region. And so some waves could be pretty large, particularly late today and into tomorrow as this low spins up and targets that coastal fringe. But for Australia today, chilly start through the southeast, a fair bit of frost on the ground but a beautiful sunny day on the way and in the west we've had our cold change move through there as well today is 10 degrees colder than yesterday with showers coming and going for perth rob thank you